Okay guys, I'm Turn Green Go Ham. Welcome back to the Immortals Phoenix Rising Let's Play. Uh, as you can see here, if I open my site, uh, I have scanned, well, <laughs> what I thought was everything. Uh, I guess there's still some stuff out there for me to find, but uh, I have scanned just all around this map. And we, and I know that, that probably makes you seasick there, but uh, we have found just every single thing that we could uh, that we could find from up here and also I went over to the statue uh, now it did trigger you know like a little uh, where, where you go this statue so it did trigger like a little uh, um, encounter halfway up but I didn't start it uh, and we did see this uh, fall out of the sky that's a uh, bonus quest to go do over there uh, as far as, you know, originally all the quests were gold if they were main story quests. I think here it's like you want to do all of these type quests because we don't actually have what you would consider like a main story icon uh, anymore. We don't have that gold anymore. We have the silver. So I think that's what we're supposed to do. But as you can see, we just got a ton of stuff discovered here. I'm going to fast travel here first, and we're going to go grab this Ambrosia. We're all about uh, Ambrosia and the vaults. That's what we're going to be tackling the most of, uh, and also the challenges, because uh, those are going to give us coins so we can upgrade our character, and these are going to give us stamina and health increases, so that's kind of what I want to target first. Uh, of course, we will be going after all of these chests on the way, because, uh, yeah, loot. So let's go ahead and head over here and grab this Ambrosia. Uh, already got that one, yeah. So we just have the one over there in the corner. So let's head out. Uh, I did also upgrade some potions. Um, I've always seemed to get enough uh, mats to make potions. So I uh, grabbed a couple of upgrades there. There's our Ambrosia. It's not even going to show us because it's uh, far away. Let's make sure we're pointed. Okay, so we need to point that way and I'm sure when we get close it'll pop up we'll grab this chest here while we're on the way uh, excuse me guys are y'all guarding anything uh, we already got that chest okay Not really interested in the guys that we've already taken care of. I'm gonna guess it's kind of around the corner here, or maybe even all the way down. Yeah, I don't see, uh... Yeah, here it is. guys out. Ooh, I thought I dodged that. I've got to get used to the dodge again. I was playing a little uh, Demon Souls earlier. No, you're not going to swoop down at me, thank you very much. And as you can see, those upgraded weapons are doing work around here. Um, back around here. Oh cool, you can actually collect from horseback. That's awesome. So what was the purpose of that door if you could just literally walk around and bust through the wall? I don't get it. Uh, brazers we need to set on fire, so we need another brazier that's already on fire. Question is, where would one of those be? There's one up there. So let's climb up here. And we'll shoot through that one and down in there to light those. There's 
times one. You know, what I've found with this game, guys, is it's it's very lighthearted and a little cheesy, yeah. But I'm just having a ton of fun. Like it's it's a nice unwind. Uh, which is kind of how I felt about uh, Breath of the Wild. Um, but it's just really enjoyable. New gear. Stone, ge uh, stone glare plate. Let's check it out. Refills 120% of a health chunk when stunning an enemy. That's not bad. What do we have on right now? Plus one to stamina chunks. I really think that's the best... Uh, we can use right now. I mean, health chunks is good too, but really, I, I find that I'm I'm missing out on stamina more than anything else. So we'll keep that on. What do we got? Forty percent damage for six seconds when stunning an enemy. What are, what other options do we have here? Unarmed, unharmed. Uh, Twenty against unique. Ten with an axe. Ten with a sword. Yeah, I think we'll keep that. We do have the new um, Axe Slam now. The Oh, we got another set of wings too. Oh, yeah, the special. Yeah, not even interested. I'll pass on those. Um, we do have the Axe Slam now, so... Uh, that Shockwave uh, stuns. We scared our horse. That's great. Um, let's go ahead and find that. Ambrosia direction again? Yeah, okay, we're headed the right direction. And I love how the horse is right over there. But you can just call it again. I stop for mats. Looks like it's directly up. Let's so see if we can make it all the way up there. It's gonna be close. It's gonna be real close. But yeah, I just find that this is a great relaxing game. Like an end of the day, just sit back and have some fun kind of game. And I really am enjoying it. Uh, if you guys haven't played it yet, I highly recommend it. The combat is fun. Uh, not overly complicated, but not overly simple either. Um, the story has uh, enough comedy in it to uh, keep me interested. Uh oh, legendary boss encounter. All right. What do we got as far as legendary boss? Are we going to be able to make it all the way up here? Uh, maybe not. Doesn't look like it. It's still showing up, though. Let's see if there's a better, shorter distance to climb over here. I mean, that'll probably be a ledge right there. Yeah, so we can recharge here. And see if we can make it all the way up from here. So yeah, if you're looking for just a good, fun game to unwind, it's just it's just really enjoyable, and I highly recommend it. We can make it to that flat spot without using a potion or something. this ambrosia up here but I also hear ooh a lion I wonder can we sneak up on that uh, ambrosia to make sure we get it so Typhon corrupted the Nemean lion after that jock Heracles skinned it you know when Heracles couldn't slay it he strangled it with his own hands sounds about right Hera unleashed the lion to torture Morax. 
Sometimes that woman. Go ahead and grab these things Jasper. over here too. May as well stock up while they're sitting here. Uh, we're going to see if we can start out with this boulder here. And just give it a nice smack in the back of the head. Okay, so that didn't hurt all that much. Let's use a potion here. Let's get a perfect dodge. Ooh, that's an AoE. All right. Gotta learn the attack patterns here. Probably trying to stun him with the, uh, yeah. Stun him with the axe here. And that should do it. We're doing alright. Let's go ahead and top off here. Just to be on the safe side. Didn't seem like it did any damage to me, though. Uh, I think I'll switch back to the sword. He's almost dead. We just need to damage. Kind of felt like I dodged that one, but okay. Alright. Legendary boss fight. Damn. What do we get for that? Phosphor of Zeus's lightning. Okay, so that's for the um, companion that we don't have yet. No chest or anything cool like that, I guess. Take a look at our map here. We're probably gonna yeah fast travel back. I'm gonna kind of scan this general area just real quick, make sure that there's nothing that I I missed. This seems like an awful open area over here. I like that you can actually scan through the rocks and stuff too. But there seems to be like nothing in this general area over here, which kind of threw me off because the map tends to be pretty packed for the most part, but it doesn't seem to be anything, so oh, there's an air vent. That would help <laughs> that would have helped us get up here a lot easier. Don't see anything down there other than the vent though, so let's head on. And we want to start heading off towards this area, so we'll fast travel here. 
And at some point, we, won't, we will go back to the uh, first island and finish uh, those areas that said we weren't strong enough yet. Because we have more stamina chunks, which means our arrows will uh, be more effective and all that. Right, so we want to turn this way and head this direction. Going for the embrasure first. Uh, and I learned something interesting as well. Uh, one of our upgrade materials is amber. And, um, you know, the other day I said, why is this tree glowing orange? Well, it's because if you chop it down, it has amber in it. So we're going to be doing that and uh, collecting all the amber we can find. Looks like this one's going to be underwater. Oh, where'd you go, buddy? Alright, so we've already got enough for another health upgrade. Got a rift and a chest off in this direction. I want to find one of those trees to show you guys. It says the chest is here, but it also says down, so... Cave? Aha! Bet that's what the enemies are guarding. Kind of check the sides though. There's been some uh, cheeky side entrances and stuff like that. So she has a hard time making that last little hop sometimes. Yeah, no, this looks straightforward. Let's get down there and uh, fight our way in. These guys are just basic now. Not a big deal at all. Oh. Huh? All right, I'll take it. Horns of the Rebels. 10% damage while stamina is full. That stamina is never full, so we'll pass on that. Is that really all there was to this room? Guess so. feel like those guys should just be out there for nothing, right? They should be guarding something. Oh, uh, currency. I mean, we can go take some bears down. Why not? Can we sneak up on one? Do a little stealth attack. Nope. Nope. He saw us. Come on then, buddy. Oh, he's gonna wait for his friend. That's what's gonna happen. Okay, dude. I was literally banging on dodge. Oh, nice. He hit his buddy. Ah! 
I don't like his attacks. I don't like being close for his attacks. Because like that, he likes to do some random three, three count attacks. And I seem to only ever be able to dodge the last one. That's right, we got him down. Let's get our loot. Hundred and fifty upgrade stones. And I guess that's it. So is it me or was I down more than one bar? Did that did that slowly fill up? I'll have to go back and look at that later. Alright, let's head off to the vault. Time to grab a Zeus's lightning. Is it that it will it will refill whatever current chunk you're on? Is that how it works? I have to figure all that out. Still pretty new to the game. Oh, we've got a couple of boards down here. We gotta make sure we look off to the sides and everything for uh, chests. See another air vent back there. Does that mean I have to make it all the way? Yep. It looks like we did it. Oh, there we go. So I can see the beam for the chest. It's directly in front of us. Okay, we got our save point. So they don't all go the same distance. I wonder if it kind of knows, you know, depending on where it's lined up, uh, which level, like height-wise, to kind of aim for. Well, 
Oh. That went way, way up there. Oh, looks like we actually got it where it's supposed to go. It's coming down. Yeah, okay. But I do see our chest up there, so let's go scope that out. We gotta get a ball here. <laughs> Lucky for us, we knocked one up here. Aha! <laughs> well, that was easy on accident. What does this helm do? 40% damage for 6 seconds on health potion usage. I mean, that's not bad. But I think uh, the stun is a little better. Since we have the hammer. We're going to be using the hammer a lot more than we're going to be using the health potions. At least I hope, anyway. Okay, so this one landed over here. And turned these on. Okay, so we just go up. And looks like we've got some more boulders to throw. They seem a little more stubborn than the last one. They don't like to just break away. Those are wood boxes. I bet we have to break those open. Try to clear some of this out. Yeah, all right. So now I guess we have to launch one over to that little jet stream. Okay. Roll too far? Nope, it landed. All right. It's a long jump, man. Okay, so that's where we started. Right? Yeah, way over there. Alright, we're heading the wrong way. Hey, alright. What is this? Here, Tear of Aphrodite. found the tear that marked the tragic final moments of Adonis. The love Aphrodite felt for him would never die. All right, all right. She was sad. I get it. The 
Let's get that stamina. Up. is up there. Yeah, I couldn't even drop back in there anymore. Okay, let's check out the map, see what's next. Uh, we left an ambrosia like right next to the Hall of the Gods. That sucks, but we'll grab it. Did we ever... We never got that. It said we weren't strong enough. We need to remember to go get that uh, after we you know, decide to go back for all of this as well. And we definitely want to come back here because uh, the challenges give you the coins which uh, upgrade our character. So anyway, let's go ahead and put a pin here and then we'll just kind of work our way all around in here. After we get over there, we've got another unexplored vault over there. Uh, we're gonna stop here and fight these because I see fruit in the trees and we can use that. Are they are they not wild? Were they not angry and I beat them up anyway? Hey, all right. Now I feel bad. I uh, I harmed a, a helpless boar. I'm sorry about your friend. Are you angry? Uh, no, you're pretty friendly, it looks like. There's still more up in there. Okay, now they're angry. Why did he all roll over for me? Yeah, hit that tree. Knock yourself out. Why, why did he roll over for me like he wanted me to scratch his belly and then all of a sudden attack me? That was kind of odd. Yeah, more fruit? Yes, more fruit. Yeah, we always need to be able to craft more potions. I don't know how many of those it takes for a potion, but the potions are vastly more powerful. Uh, there's some more over there. Says it's down. Aha. Get off the wall. She's so sticky everywhere you go. She just sticks to stuff. That was uh that was how Link was too in the Breath of the Wild. Tethys, daughter of Gaia and Oceanus, god of the world's largest river, had their wedding in the very cave. Phoenix had just entered. Together, they had 6,000 children. 6,000? That's way too many. Keep it small like me. I'm only at 54. That I know of, anyway. So Ooh. responsible. 54. I'll, I'll pass on that. Uh, turn right. We want to go to that guarded chest first. That's the good stuff. <laughs> Oh, 
Can we make it? Yes. What do we got? Looks like a uh, Minotaur and some of the uh, Worm Bros. do that all the time. Ooh. Was late on that for sure. Minotaur just over there doing his own thing. I'll take it. Man, you broke that other brick I was going to use on you. Something so satisfying about ragdolling them out of existence. That's fantastic. New weapon resistance. Crowd shot inflicts 150 stun and knocks back small enemies. 30% damage with both shots while our health is full. Yeah, let's do this. Our health, <laughs> our health is hardly ever full. Plus that uh, kind of matches the rest of our outfit there, though. So. Oh, time to upgrade our weapons again. I wish the uh, I wish the mini map up top showed just a little bit further. Um, if we do this, we can kind of make a snake down to there. So let's go here first. in that cave. Come on, snake buddy. Yeah. those outrageous resistance. Alright, that's one of two. Oh. That's nice. We don't even need boulders anymore. And apparently we don't need that door either. Open that door. How do I open that door? Aha! Yes, sir.
Okay, so that opened this. I still want that room with all the uh, pomegranate and stuff. But... percent chance to gather, that'd be nice. Seven percent of a health chunk on hit with combo finishers. That's not too bad. Hmm. Kind of like a last stand defense. Oh no, that's why health is full. Okay. So like the first hit you take wouldn't take that much damage. I kind of like that. Um. I can see how some of these would kind of work together too, so be interested to see what kind of combinations of gear you can do later. Like, uh, I'm really looking for a chess piece that does something when you stun, and then that when you stun, so, uh, you know, we can kind of stack capacity of you collecting up your adamantine shards to upgrade Phoenix's carrying capacities. Alright. So this door still isn't open that means we have another uh, crystal to hit and hopefully that opens the door inside too so let's look for that crystal I mean that's obviously one where's the other I mean, I guess the other one's not going to be easy, though, right? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Material. Now we can max our potions again. I don't feel that I need potions all that often, to be honest with you. But they're nice to have in a pinch. I see some big boys. Can I hit you? Yeah. Oh, that was a one shot. That was very, very nice. Stamina back before they get here. Okay, so we earn stamina back with sword attacks. That's cool. So we can parry it. I was hoping maybe I could hit her with it. Oh, we can. Nice. This is just you and me, big boy. What are you doing? Do you have any idea what's actually going on right now? Get over here. Are we just gonna keep walking towards that tree? Is this gonna be just a free kill here? Man, that damage on stun is so nice. Well, I thought we were, I thought he was just gonna stand there and wait for him. But I mean, he pretty much did. We did have to finish him off, though. That's not what I wanted to do. Pick it up. Alright. What do we got here? 
New weapon. I like it. 33% damage for 6 seconds on perfect dodge. Yes. Yes, no, that's way better. Yeah, okay. I'm finding some uh, pieces that I really like now. What else we got going on? We still have all... Well, man, we still have so much. Let's go ahead and mark this. Do that and uh, head on to the next vault. Okay, just wanted to just wanted to see what happened. Uh, the horse bails out. Oh, there's some more horses we could take. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's what we were headed to. All right. It, it looked like it was further than it was because it was showing the vault distance. stamina right may as well until he tries to throw a boulder at us which he's about to pick up try regular all right all right throw the boulder my turn well pick it up hold it I'm thinking uh, next time we stun one of these guys, we ought to pop a potion and see what that uh, bonus damage to stun looks like with this on top of it, with that potion on top of it. Because I did upgrade it a couple of times. I want to say uh, 60% or percent is what I get. The damage? What? That not, that's not. That's a big boulder, and that's not enough. Why is that so shiny? What else we got? Some wood. Stay on there. Still not enough. Need one more piece. I'm really surprised that boulder didn't do it by itself. Usually the boulders will open any pressure plate. Ah, it didn't really stay on there. Or no, the other one fell off. That's what happened. I feel like the boulder should be big enough and it's not it's not doing it. Hang on. Move. Move. Can I push this? Yeah. I want it right on the edge there. Right there. 
and you go right here. All right. Stormy Helm of the Vulture. 20% damage while midair. Uh, that's nice. I do juggle, but uh, I think we'll stick with the damage when stunned. Okay, what's next? Should be the, uh, yeah, the rift. Vault. This way out here. Oceans of Offspring. Okay. We'll check that out later. We're gonna head over here to the vault. Probably do this vault and then wrap up this episode. Oh, guarded rig. Oh, we missed him. Ha! Nice. You really have to hit a perfect dodge on that, or you'll kind of get hit. Alright, use the attack potion. Yeah. Oh, that's big, big damage. I just had to test that out there. In we go. This is an easy one, so hopefully it uh, won't take long here. We'll get this episode wrapped up. Whoa. Settle down there, buddy. There's spikes in the floor. And some enemies. Oh look, they can uh, they can get hurt by the spikes too. You can kind of lure them. Ooh. Yeah, except we got stuck on it too. Hey, look, you're not supposed to swing at me when I've got you, like, you know, stunned and stuff. Stop swinging right when I'm in the middle of my swing. That's enough. I do feel like I need something like a, a little heal on a combo finish though. That would keep me from ever having to use my potion pretty much. Where did you even come from? He kind of looks like he's going to swing when he's not swinging. Is this just kind of like a battle test? Is that what this is? Uh, yeah, one more, one more wave it looks like. You thought you were being sneaky.
Aw, oh, no more? Uh, there is a chest over there. How do I get there? Oh, what? <laughs> Two of these guys? Ooh, that's bad. Maybe I should have not. Uh, hit that switch. Yeah, get on those spikes. I totally just wasted. See, it seems like every time they're gonna hit me, I get a post in the face. See through post, and they like to take turns too. Catch me when I'm slipping. Oh, I felt like that was a dodge, but okay. He's a fast little booger, even when you're in slow mo. We get one of them dead, I'll be all right. There we go. Now you're gonna be much easier to deal with. To the chest now. Yes, indeed. Well, we had to use our potions, but we got it done. Molten fragment. What is that? See, okay, yeah, you do have to go to the cauldron. But we do have seven amber. Uh, yeah, 60% on that. It takes 14 for the next one. We'll probably do, well, six is all we need for right now. So maybe, yeah, stamina report would be nice. We don't really use the, uh, ooh. No, yeah, that's nice because in addition to the 60% damage, we get health chunks too. I think we're gonna have to go this route. Oh man, that gets nice towards the end. All right. Yeah, that's gonna be our. I totally forgot what I was doing. We're we're looking at. Show me the menu. There we go. What is this? Powerful armor. Okay. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. We are getting a little long in the tooth for an episode, so let's get on out of here. I have a hard time keeping these episodes short. There's just so much to do in this game. got two. We need four, I think, for our next chunk of stamina. Uh, 
Okay, guys. So, man, we still have just so much to do on this map. But uh, that's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, if you guys if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel uh, and hit that notifications icon if you want to be notified anytime new videos come out. Uh, also, uh, don't forget to hit me up in the comments section. I enjoy chatting with you guys. So, uh, till the next video. Thanks for watching.